guys welcome back to my channel it's your girl a zinni williams how are you all doing hope you guys are good hope you guys are fine if you're new to this channel kindly click on the subscription button click on the notification bell to let you know whenever i post any new video okay guys so we are done with that lengthy head of house games our mother head of house games was quite something if you watched um the veto i think the ultimate veto veto power game that chi chi won it's exactly the same game even when at the clay saw it he was like wow because he played that game that day and chi chi won so they were divided into four different groups comprising of five housemates yes guys so batch by batch team by team they walked into the arena they faced the challenge and and the first batch, it was Ike and Kidwire that won for their team. The second was Neo and Ilebaye. And the third was Fraud and Venita. The fifth was, I think, Adekule and Soma. Yes, guys. So at the end of all that, before the final head of house game, that is the final round of the head of house games, the black envelope challenge was done. And immediately, I think Kidware was the first person to find the black envelope exactly where um Pere was sitting in the garden. Then Angel found one um at their vanity mirror area. And Neo also found one under that munching basket. So at the end of the day, when it was time for them to reveal the content of the envelope, Kidware got a try again later. Angel was actually the one that got the black envelope challenge immunity. And Neo also got um try again later. Yes, guys. So that means that at that point, Angel was immune from possible nomination. Then Be Better Now said that the finalists should go back to the arena to play the same game. At the end of the final round, we actually it wasn't clear between Kid and Neo who got it. It now took Big Brother to announce that it's Kid Wire that is the current head of house. But before then, the likes of Venita, even Neo himself was saying he saw something, he saw something. In my head, I was thinking, okay, maybe Neo won it. Venita was saying, you know, trying to convince Kid that she saw Neo put it first, but Kid kind of like felt bad about it. But when um, Big Brother came back with his final verdict, it turns out that Kid is the current head of house now for his bfs he chose ptolemy neo Pere, and Urel to enjoy the head of house apartments with him yes guys now mind you there is no immunity for the bfs like i mean last week obviously now it was time for the pardon me please pardon me Big Brother explained all the rules to them, which actually shocked them because they were already creating or forming alliances or who they are going to be putting on for possible eviction. But when Big Brother made that announcement, it was a game changer. Now they have to go into that um, nomination room and nominate somebody they want to pardon like the look on their faces was very very priceless yes guys so this is how the nomination went venita nominated ike for pardon cc ilebaye ike um nominated venita urel nominated soma adekule soma para cross talani bajneo cross soma Princess um, Soma, Ilebaye Doyen, White Money Mercy, aka okay, Mercy CC, um, Soma nominated Urel, Neo nominated Talani Badge, Alex nominated Soma, Sheyu nominated Soma, Fraud nominated Adekule, Doyen nominated Ilebaye, and Kit Wire nominated Soma. Now, Soma obviously is the winner of the part of me challenge like when we better announced him people of god i cannot even lie to you guys the tears were coming yeah as someone was crying as they were hugging him i won't lie the tears was also falling down my eyes like yes i know i'm a softy i cannot help it or maybe it's because i now have a crush on him i cannot help it also because i'm happy for him because of all the people there summer is one person i feel like 
every other person deserves to stay longer in the game but um he just stayed i think a week or two weeks if i'm not mistaken and you know his season was like what the second uh, season of the show so a lot of people don't even know him and a, a lot of people are not acquainted with him you cannot compare him with maybe an Ilebaye that left third week of, of the level up season you know because people already know who Ilebaye is at least to an extent but a lot of people don't know who soma is so seeing him get that yeah I can beat my futures and say Soma is one up problematic guy that a lot of the housemates love. And I love him too. So yes, a very big congratulations to Soma. So, so far, the head of house, Kidwire has immunity. Um, Angel has immunity. And Soma has immunity. Now, the rest of the 17 housemates are now up for possible evictions. Yes, guys. So yeah. Anyways, while that happened, there was a mini bus bus that happened though. Hey. Urel, my baby, my African baby, was so pissed with Odogu white money. Ha, Mazi don't piss Urel off. So they went to the commercial break, right? So we got back and Urel was angry. He was like, what do you mean white money? We are not doing a food comp cooking competition. We are not dragging the kitchen. The way you cook is not the way I cook. And my buddy was like, for me, like, what did I do? How did we get here? And Urel was like, see, of all the people here, you are the one person I know personally personally like what you're doing here is being fake you're too strategic you're being fake like um, we're not chatting on whatsapp don't we chat on whatsapp we know each other i know you personally then people that call them you know to the lounge to make the announcements and all that anyways it continued after big brother's announcement Burel and angel went into the pink room um later on they were joined by telling badge and Urel was explaining to angel what actually caused her outburst she said that whenever she is in the kitchen white money will be snooping around doing hmm, 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 everywhere now when she cooks and she gives white money he rejects her food he doesn't eat her food at all and she also cited you know an incident that happened that um she cooked jello fries one day and the very next day According to her, because people were praising her, saying, oh, Ural, you're the best cook. Oh, Ural, I love your food and all that. Why many now decided to make the same jollof fries? Like, in her head, she's wondering, why is he doing that? She also cited an incident that happened, I think, when Ural was talking about her mom. Now, if you are somebody that have been following Ural for a very long time, like me, you all know that Ural has always been there for her mom. You know, you are, Ural has always been posting about her mom. You know, her mom is not really strong health-wise. So we all know this. And apparently, White Money also know because White Money is quite close to Ural outside of the house. So according to Ural, she was talking about her mom and all that. And White Money made a statement like, oh, I mean... Um, you already posted your mom on WhatsApp or something like that. Why are you still worried or something like that? Trying to invalidate what she was feeling, like trying to say, oh, yeah, you're trying to use your mom to buy sympathy, like your mom is or supposed to be okay. You know, that kind of thing. So Urel is like pissed about that. If I'm in her shoes, I think I'll be pissed too. Honestly, I understand where Urel is coming from. If it's another person that probably did that, I bet she will not react the way she did. Like white money, you just imagine somebody you knew from outside of the house. And then when the person comes into the house, the person is giving you some kind of attitude, you know, trying to act some type of way. Of course, you call them out on their BS. And that's what Urel did. And honestly... Ural is not the only one that's talking about white money using the cooking as a strategy. I mean, everybody was shouting about it in his season. Me, I'm not saying there's anything wrong in being strategic because trust me, everybody in that house is a game player. They are all playing a game. But then there is, I feel like there is an extent you can go, not try to make another person look bad, especially somebody you know from outside. I know the game is the game, but you will not lose a genuine friendship or relationship over a game that you are not even 100% sure that you're going to win. Like, I hope, I think I'm making sense with this. So I get where URL is coming from. So and white money tried to act like, oh, I mean, URL, what is it? How do you like acting so ignorant that he doesn't know what's happening? That's fake. I'm going to say with my full chest, I feel like that's fake because he knows, you know, like it's somehow, her reason on the outside might look very um, petty, 
But if you look at the feelings behind it, it actually makes sense. Also, Doyin is quite pissed with Kid Wire because according to Doyin, she was on her own. No, she was on her own. That is how Kid Wire came, forming alliance. Even in the, I think when she and Ilebaye were in the toilet area, he came trying to form an alliance and everything, promising her that, okay, if I win head of house, I'll make you one of uh, my BFFs. And he didn't do that. Now, Doing is so pissed and she's saying like she was on her own like it's a different thing if i go to you to ask of this but i was on my own and you decided you know what i'm going to do this for you she said that that kind of situation she does not like it at all honestly i also do understand you know doing but then again people are playing games so whatever you're doing in that house you just have to be wise about it don't be tr too trusting of anybody you see in the house honestly now away from that let's go to some of the things i've noticed let's talk about neo this neo eh? i don't know you can see neo and talani but they are not beating that um accusation or that speculation that they don't have something together on the outside they are not like did you see him holding talani Baj's waist like I think they are in that space where they are tired of hiding anymore. But then again, Neo has refused to let Ilebaye be. It's not the Ilebaye that he was saying, oh, she's the one harassing me. She's, but he's the one dragging her, calling Ilebaye, wanting Ilebaye to be by his side. I don't understand that. Neo, let this girl be before you start accusing her now and your sister will come and do Defender of the Defenseless tomorrow. I beg you. Anyways, these are some of the things that happen. I'm sure a lot of drama will still happen based on some of the things, you know, that had already happened. Let me know your thoughts on all of this in the comment section. On that note, I'd like to say a very big thank you to you all for being part of my channel. If you have not yet subscribed, can you click on the subscription button, click on the notification bell to let you know know whenever i post any new video until i come your way again i remain your darling girl az me williams have yourself a beautiful wonderful day ahead